My Little Pony, My Little Pony, uh, it is actually, uh, Rapidash, which is basically the unboxing I am going to do of the Galarian Rapidash Pokemon box. Now, uh, I actually am kind of impressed with the design work on this. They actually, if you look really closely, um, right here, they have some glitter on the, uh, packaging. I think they really went, really went out of their way with the packaging for the Galarian Rapidash set. Inside the, inside of the product itself contains the, uh, the Galarian Rapidash V card, obviously, and the oversized version of the card. Also, uh, four Pokemon booster packs and a code card for Pokemon TCG Online. And here is the, uh, back of the box right here. Oops. And the front, obviously. So, uh, get the chair. let's, uh, get started. And in case you're wondering what, uh, shirt I'm wearing, it's, uh, it's from an isekai anime manga called... I meant to say manga, but it's from an isekai manga called Love and Hell. Check it out. It's a pretty awesome series. And, um... Anyway, let's... And the shirt is by Uncivil Illustrations, so be sure to check out some of their stuff. That's Uncivil Illustrations. They make some pretty awesome anime shirts. They even make a couple Yu-Gi-Oh! shirts, also. I have a couple of them. I've even, like, did an unboxing for Uncivil Illustrations earlier in one of my videos. But I'm getting off subject. Let's get started on unboxing this thing. Yeah. Hopefully, I can do this without getting any paper cuts. try to go out of my way to get the card out of there. And, oh. Oh. Huh. There's the card. Rapid Galarian Rapidashly. Alright. The design of the Galarian version of Rapidash kind of definitely has that My Little Pony vibe to this Pokemon, and kind of reminds me a little bit of Flurry Heart from My Little Pony. Now the effects of uh, Rapidash V are Libra Horn, put damage counters on one of your opponent's Pokemon until its remaining HP is 100. I guess that effect could be useful against really powerful Pokemon. Colossal HP, but it seems a little bit more uh, self-harming or counterproductive than it should be. And then there's Psychic Move, uh, 60 plus. Attack does 30, wait, 30 more damage for each energy card attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. And here's the card itself, in case you guys wanted to see it. Alright, and uh, comes with the oversized Rapidash Swag. If any guys know about or remember the Pony Dot Move series, <laughs> good for you. Now, enough of that. We got the packs. We got two battle styles. Darkness Ablaze and Rebel Clash. First off, um... I'm going to start off with the two Battle Styles packs. Really aiming for that Full Art Tyranitar V. Even though I could just order it online, which I'm probably going to end up doing. <laughs> now, let's start. We got a uh, Shinx, Kecnia, Ponyard, one of my favorite Dark Steel type Pokemon. 
here. And uh, timber, Tepig. And we are reaching the moment of truth. Let's see what we get. Scent Scorch, Reverse Hollow. And uh, Marowak Rare. Okay. Dark Energy. Heat more. Single strike. Scroll of stone. Ooh, by sharp. Another uh, favorite dark steel type evolved from uh, Ponyard. And here is the uh, Pokemon code in case anybody wants it. I'm gonna hold it up for a total of five, four, three, two, and one. On to the next battle styles. All right, we got uh, Molly. I'm probably not saying that some of the Pokemon card names right, but you know, I'm just gonna get some of these organized a little bit. Cherubi, Pachirisu, Chimicho, Honedge. Uh, heat more, and ooh, I think we're hitting a uh, full art or V Max card. Flapple V Max, Steel Energy, Weepin Bell, Indeedy, Sword and Shieldbert. Definitely getting some Siegfried and Roy vibes from these two. I'm not sure if that was the uh, homage that Nintendo was paying tribute to, but you never know. And here is the uh, card for anyone who wants it. And it is going in... Better pause the screen for this. In five, four, three, two, and one. And here's the uh, card that came with the V-Box. Going. Pause the screen. Okay, you got all that? Good. Okay. Now, on to the darkness ablaze. Man, that's cheesy. <laughs> Torchic. Yeah. Mariani. Yeah. Kalink. Dumpsparse. Jigglypuff, a wishy washy reverse hollow, wickedly tough, darkness energy, ha, huh. pretty fitting when you think about it. De Denny, Steeny, the Rose Tower, and oh, hmm, hat backwards, but here we go. One, uh, one card. Passcode card. Which unlocks 10 additional cards to play and compete online. So, there you go. And last and final pack. Rebel Clash. I am kind of unfamiliar with what the most expensive card in Rebel Clash is. But if anyone can let, tell me in the comments section, uh, feel free to let me know. Or I can, I'll just look it up. Never mind. Either way. The gloomy looking bear, Stuffle. Lotad. Uh, Growlithe. Roly Colioli. Meditite. Huh, one of my favorite Sword and Shield Pokemon. Impidimp. And that's. Oh! This one's a reverse hollow. And Galarian Darmanaton fell down. Fighting Energy. Draculoic. Lampent. Galar Mine. All Mine. I'm joking, of course. Not all mine. And, uh, feel free to redeem this. One. Pause the screen. Okay, you got it. 
You get it? Got it? Okay. Good. All together, that was kind of a great card to use in a psychic deck, but overall what I got from that... Overall what I got from those... Anyway, as I was saying... Overall, what I got from those packs is a little bit lackluster. I probably will only be using like a few of those cards in a deck, but all together, this is a pretty fun little box. I'm actually, again, I'm impressed with the detail that went into some of the packaging for this Rapidash V box. And it wasn't even one that had like any coins or figurines or anything in it, but overall, that was actually impressive, so... What I pulled out of the packs could have been better, but I plan to use Rapidash in a deck that I'm building soon. The Galarian Rapidash. Anyway, uh, I will see you guys in the next unboxing video. Next one I'm going to do is a Pokemon tin I got. I'm going to be unboxing that. So anyway, I'll see you guys later. Peace.